Scientists in this lab in southern Japan have announced a medical breakthrough. They say they've discovered a more reliable way to make stem cells. This is potentially big news for medics because stem cells can be used to replace or heal damaged tissues and cells in the body. Currently, they're either made by harvesting cells from human embryos or reprogramming adult blood or skin cells. But these methods are controversial, can take weeks and be unsuccessful. Nobody believed me when I told them what I'd found. So one time when I was lying awake in bed at night, I said to myself I'd scrap the experiment completely if I didn't get results the next day. Well, that next day sort of turned into five years. The team at the Riken Centre for Developmental Biology found that skin and blood cells subjected to a weak acid bath, almost to the point of death, for around 30 minutes, would recover over a three-day period, reverting into a similar state to that of an embryonic stem cell. In the future, this will potentially allow us to carry out organ regeneration in the body and could help us to understand how we can control the production of stem cells to create cancer control technology. This mouse embryo with a beating heart muscle has been made entirely from the newly formed STAP stem cells. I haven't simply dreamed this up to offer a solution to some sort of single limited problem. My main desire is to create something that benefits all of human society, not just now, but in 10 or even 100 years' time. Scientists are hoping that because stem cells can help regenerate tissue and even potentially grow new organs, they could offer new ways of tackling diseases. Chloe Culpin, Sky News.